Three minutes. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I thank my friend for yielding. I rise today in support of House Resolution 1165, condemning the Assad regime and its backers for their continued support of war crimes and crimes against humanity in Syria. Nearly half a million Syrians killed, 14 million Syrians displaced, countless acts of atrocities from the Assad regime supported by its backers in Iran and in Russia. Clearly it is right that Congress takes this step and acts. This resolution urges a political solution to this conflict to ensure the Assad regime cannot use the air to target its own civilians. And this resolution brings much needed attention to the atrocities of this regime, which is responsible for horrific crimes, again, against its own people. Mr. Speaker, I want to recognize and thank my colleagues for their hard work and advocacy for this resolution that seeks to hold this regime accountable. I thank them for their hard work. I urge my colleagues to pass this legislation that shines a light, a bright light, on what is happening in Syria and the crimes committed by the Assad regime along with its backers in Russia and in Iran. Uh, I urge the passage of this resolution and again I thank my colleagues for their work on this effort. 